I'm Brian Westbrook with GeekWire Studios here at NVIDIA GTC, chatting with the Nebbia Senior AI Product Marketing Manager, Dylan Bristow. Dylan, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks for having me, it's great to be here. So we are talking about Nebbia's AI Studio and how it helps organizations get started on their AI journey. Why don't you walk us through what it is and why is it different? So Nebius AI Studio is an inference as a service platform that uh, gives developers a direct access to the latest AI open source models like Llama, Mistral, DeepSeek, and a couple of them more. Um, we've seen that a lot of uh, developers and companies struggle when it comes to AI deployment because they're faced with a lot of um, complexity, steep learning curve, infrastructure complexity, and high costs. Nebius AI Studio gets rid of all that. We take care of doing the heavy lifting for you and allow you to just focus on building. What we provide you is a unified API and a playground where you can just access these different models, compare them, and then pull that into your projects. Tell us about the main services that Nebius AI Studio offers, and really, how does it make them stand out in the market? So Nebius AI Studio offers a full suite of services uh, ranging from text generation, as I said, with models like DeepSeek or Mistral or Llama, to uh, image generation with Flux uh, and Stable Diffusion XL. We also have embedding models uh, for people looking to do uh, RAG implementations and the ability to do fine tuning. So we have fine tuning, either full fine tuning and LoRa fine tuning that you can then host and run inference on uh, for people looking to kind of specialize base models into more specific use cases. Um, one of the ways we stand out on the market is really on a few things. So I, I would say first off is the fact that we have both a base and a fast option for all of these models. So we have two different endpoints, whether you're looking for um, speed or cost effectiveness. We also have uh, really high rate limits with industry standards uh, standing and ranging around 400K, which is what we offer for most of the malls, uh, ranging up to 100 million tokens per minute. So if you're looking to scale and experiment without limits, I guess AI Studio, Nibis AI Studio is one of the best solutions out there. What would you say from a value proposition standpoint? Let's talk dollars for a second. How does it compare to the competition? Um, I would say we are probably one of the most cost-effective solutions uh, for inference on the market out there. I guess then it depends on what model you pick, but if you look at the rankings on artificial analysis, for example, uh, Nibius AI Studio will probably most likely be on the lower end of the spectrums in terms of pricing, but without giving up on quality or speed. So I, I, that's why I like the term cost effectiveness, because I think we're one of the most cost effective solutions, meaning you don't pay a lot, but what you get is good quality. And also associated with enterprise grade, reliability, scalability, and cost effectiveness. During the course of the time here today at NVIDIA GTC, you've been talking to a lot of customers and engaging potential customers. What are you hearing from them and how would you encourage others getting started? Um, I guess customers are all curious. Uh, what they are looking for mostly is, uh, like a lot of people are chasing the hype, obviously, so trying to figure out which, which latest model comes out, how that can impact their potential job and their company and their processes and stuff like that. So I think the main uh, keyword I would, I would see here is curiosity. I think that's what people look for. Um, then on the more like technical side, I mentioned rate limits. I think uh, when talking with people working with other providers, they often mention that rate limits are a huge blocker to their use cases. And in that sense, I think we address that problem um, quite effectively. What's next for AI Studio? Um, a lot of stuff I think we're going to be uh, we're going to be focusing on adding the latest model, uh, optimizing our stack, making the whole product even more efficient. Uh, then there's also adding breadth to the product, like depth. So we're going to be adding modalities, uh, going a little deeper. We potentially have plans to add video later. So I think it's all about expanding the suite of solution, providing a more comprehensive approach, allowing people to actually do everything from one unified platform without having to uh, go to different providers to pick different tools. So I think that's kind of the main thing, is providing a more complete, reliable, and scalable product overall. One of the things you've been showing off here at the booth is a demo of AI Studio. Yeah. Walk me through it. So basically it's a demo of the game Street Fighter. So the idea is we run it on a web-based uh, emulator um, and it's running on WebAssembly. And so the idea is to have figure out how these vision models can actually play the game uh, instead of humans. So the way it works is we have the emulation of the, re the game running on a browser. Then the game takes screenshots of the, of the characters in the game every few seconds and sends them to a vision model. The vision model we use here is Lava 1.57b, which is a very small vision model which provide very fast answers. And so that model, um, upon receiving the screenshots, understands what the game, what's happening in the game, and provides the model with a decision on the next play. And so both models do that at the same time, and that creates some sort of uh, creative loop where the model is fed with the information of what's happening on the screen, takes a decision on the next action, and goes up again. And I think that's a great example of what vision models can do. 
Um, I know they're being used more and more in different use cases like OCR, tech, rec tech extraction from documents and security, et cetera. And so I think using such examples is a great way to showcase how these vision models can help us on a day-to-day -day basis. This, of course, is just a fun example, but I think you can take it one step further and rely on these vision models to do more and more things in the future. Well, thank you very much. Dylan is the Senior AI Product Marketing Manager for Nebias. I'm Brian Westbrook with GeekWire Studios. Thanks for watching.